There's another way we can demonstrate the conservation of mechanical energy with our bowling ball, and that is to, uh, let's see, release it over here. We'll call this the initial. Let it swing, see where it goes, and it's going to end somewhere around here, the final. Let's apply uh, conservation of energy to that. That would be delta K plus delta U equals zero is the convenient formula. And we're thinking this is the initial and the final, and this is the point where it stops. It swings up, stops to go the other way. So at both positions, it's at rest. So the final kinetic energy is zero, and the initial kinetic energy is zero because the velocity is zero. For the height, we'll say we started it above the ground at some height yi, and we'll say it's going to end up at some height yf. So the potential energies are final is mgyf minus initial mgyi. And all that has to equal zero. So you can see where we're headed here, zero, 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 bring this over here, and you get mgyf equals mgyi, cancel, 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 and you get that it must end at the same height that it started, because we have to conserve energy, right? If there's no kinetic involved in these two positions, then you have to have the same potential energy, and it has to be at the same height. Um, we could go a little further and say, what if we started here, went to here, and then let it come back to here? What if we made, and then say it'll stop, and we make that the final state, initial final. Then we would have an initial height yi, a final height yf, but the same argument would apply. It would have to end up at the same height it started at, which leads to one of the most popular demonstrations in intro mechanics. So what I'm going to do is crawl up here and hold the ball against my face and release it. And if it obeys conservation of energy, it'll come to the exact same height and I'll be fine. It could go higher and then it would crush my face, but it's not going to because it's going to obey conservation of energy. Now, I really don't like this demo because to me, there's not a lot of dramatic tension because one, I know you've seen this before, you've seen it done before. And two, if a physicist gets their face messed up, does it really matter? You know, so I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to do it different. I'm going to, I'm going to raise the stakes. Or you might say, I'm going to lower them. I'm going to do it from here and I'm going to hold it here. So I cannot possibly back up any farther. I'm hanging off the edge of the bench and I'm going to hold it here and release it. I give you the Hafner's Cradle. I'm not nervous at all because I believe in the conservation of energy. <laughs>